here's what I found to be extremely interesting. No one else might, but I don't know. All of these I got from the original owner, piece by piece. Not directly from the original owner, but I put them together off eBay. I got minus Frank Robinson and minus Mickey Mantle. At one point in time, I bought this big stack. These, and then I got a couple other ones too. And, uh on eBay for like 60 bucks. I think it was 60 cards for 60 bucks and had the Hank Aaron. No one wanted them because they all had this mark on the back. And I could care less if cards have a mark on the back, so I bought them. Even look at this, why do Ford's got this mark? And I don't know, I didn't care. I thought nothing of it. And then about a year went by, and I saw this card for sale. And then that had that on the back. I was like, wow, where else did I see that before? And it's like, oh yeah, those cards I already bought. And the same thing with the Frank Robinson. Maybe I'll eventually find more, but this kid really marked them good, so. 65 years later, we know who, uh, who these cards belong to. They belong to JGU.